Buy your collection at Walmart stores and walmart.com. Yes, there are thousands in our family. Their work is an integral part of what will be the best picture of the year and of every picture of every year. The award that is about to be given then is a tribute to each and every one of them. The best motion picture is... Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. We're in the midst of our 31 Days of Oscar Festival here on TCM this February 19th. And right now we're looking at all five of the nominees up for the Oscar for Best Supporting Actor in the Movie World in 1937. Our next film is one of them, a terrific movie which involves legal matters, military law, also a real-life attempt by a desperate man to prove his innocence when much of the world has accepted that he's guilty of a crime he didn't commit. The movie is The Life of Emil Zola, and it stars one of the masters of the Hollywood biopic genre, Paul Muni. Also features Gloria Holden and Joseph Schokraut. Schokraut, who was not only nominated for Best Supporting Actor for this movie, he ended up winning for his performance. The title of the film, The Life of Emil Zola, is actually a misnomer. Yeah, a central presence in this movie is France's great man of letters, Zola, but unlike so many movie bios, this one doesn't try to tell the whole story of Zola's life. Indeed, it skips very quickly over his early years and career, and instead concentrates on one major incident in his life, a huge fight that Zola took on in the 1890s when he tried to help a French army officer named Alfred Dreyfus, who Zola and many others felt had been convicted of treason unjustly. Dreyfus had been sentenced to life imprisonment on Devil's Island, which is as bad or maybe worse than a death sentence. Anyway, it's a true case, and all during that time, everybody had a theory or an opinion on whether Dreyfus was guilty or just a scapegoat or railroaded because he was Jewish. It's a very engrossing story and movie, and the movie's so popular with audiences, it started a whole wave of films which tackled other social issues in the movies, Warner Brothers Studios leading the pack in producing them. This film about Zola and Dreyfus was nominated for a total of 10 Academy Awards, and in addition to the Best Supporting Actor win for Joseph Schokraut, the film also walked away with a much coveted Best Picture of the Year award. Here from 1937, directed by William Dieterle, The Life of Emil Zola. <laughs> 